This is Mato. In this video, I will show you a game between Dina Belenkaya and Alina Kashinskaya. Hmm. I noticed it's rhyming. Belenkaya and the Kashinskaya. Okay, Mato, stop making fun of other people's names. Your name is also funny. Mato. What kind of name is that? This is the game from Russian women team chess championship played in Sochi, Russia in 2016. Dina Belenkaya had white pieces and she started with e4. Alina Kashinskaya played e6. d4, d5. Black to move. By now, do you know who is Belenkaya and who is Kashinskaya? Huh? Who has white pieces and who has black pieces? Of course, Belenkaya had white pieces and Kashinskaya had black pieces. Belenkaya played knight to d2. c5, the standard move. e takes on d5. Black to move. There are two ways to recapture. Pawn takes pawn and queen takes pawn. But sometimes black plays c takes on d4. In our game we have queen takes on d5. d takes on c5. Bishop takes pawn on c5. Knight from g to f3. Knight to f6. Bishop to d3. Black to move. What is the name of player with black pieces? Alina Kashinskaya. She castled kingside. Queen to e2. Knight from b to d7. Knight to e4, attacking the bishop. b6. Knight takes bishop. Knight takes knight. Attacking the bishop on d3. Bishop to c4. Queen to c6. White move. What is the name of player with white pieces? Hmm? Do you remember? Dina Belenkaya. Dina Belenkaya castled kingside. Bishop to b7. If knight moves, queen takes pawn on g2. Rook to d1. a6. Player with black pieces is quite pleased with her opening. What is her name? Her name is Dina Belenkaya. Is that right? No, Dina Belenkaya is played with white pieces. This is Alina Kaslinskaya. The game continued. Dina Belenkaya played. <laughs> Dina Belenkaya played Queen to one I'm having lots of fun. Well. Maybe this is not the best move. Developing black would be better. Maybe bishop to e3 or bishop to g5. In the game we have queen to e1. Rook from f to e8. Bishop to f1, intending c4, b3, bishop to b2. Knight from c to d7. c4, e5. b3, queen to c7, queen to c3. Knight to c5, bishop to b2. X-laying the pawn on g7. Knight to g4. Knight to d2. Rook from a to d8. h3. Attacking the knight. What is the best square for this knight? What is the best move? This is a very interesting moment of the game. Please pause the video and find the best move for black. Did you pause? What did you find? Did you find this beautiful move? Huh? Just kidding. Alina Kashinskaya. Play the knight takes on f2. 
very powerful move. Play with white pieces. What's her name? Dina. She wanted to resign. But she remembered that people watching this game on YouTube would nag. So for their sake, she continued to play some more moves. So it's white to move. Dina Belenkaya played rook to e1. Did you see what happens if king takes knight? If king takes knight, then what is the follow-up? Black knight would love to jump to e4, but the knight on d2 is defender. So rook takes the defender, check. Rook takes rook and now family fork, winning the game. That is why Dina Belenkaya played rook to e1, knight from c to d3, bishop to a3. This is not very scary move. Queen to c6, eyeing the pawn on g2, rook to e3, queen to g6, king to h2, queen to g5 attacking the rook, rook to e2, queen to f4 check creating weaknesses, g3 was played, queen to h6 intending queen to c6, bishop to c1, queen to c6 threatening queen to h1, check mate. It is really very difficult to defend this position. Knight to e4, knight takes knight, queen to c2, well, the obvious move, obvious move, rook takes knight is also losing. This is just prolonging the, the game, queen to c2, black to move, black played a move and white resigned. The move is knight from e to f2, white resigned in view of this continuation, g4, queen to h1. Check, king to g3, queen takes bishop, rook takes knight, knight takes rook, queen takes knight on f2, rook to d3 check, bishop to e3, rook takes bishop, queen takes bishop, queen takes rook on a1, and we can stop here. And let's go back to this very interesting moment. This is the moment. Did you find the killer move? If you did, congratulations. What do you think of this game? What are the names of the players? Can you remember? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.